All right, welcome to Smokey's UK Rap Vibes. And on this one, we have one from R187. Shout out to you. You said that uh, scrap, scraps and gigs around here is going to be something that I'm going to enjoy. Uh, you said trust you, so we're going to trust you. Let's see if you can actually put me on to a good record. You have already activated a partial cheat code. I am preferential to gigs. That's my boy. I like that nigga's style. Not a lot of niggas can make it work with doing very little and still make me interested. So I'm like, yeah, I fuck with that shit. So hopefully Scraps keeps it up. I heard some other record the other day that I haven't put out yet from Scraps that wasn't too bad. So yeah, uh, let's check this out. If you could, please hit that like and subscribe and let's go. GRM. The end of the beginning. Oh shit! I ain't put two and two together. I thought Scraps was the guy who uh, Mike GLC sat down with at the RTM podcast. That's not Scraps. This is Scraps. I'm like Scraps, the other dude that just beat. Well, he had a mistrial. He ain't beat it yet, so he's attempting. But uh, man, just bust case partially. Whip it in the house, whip it in the flat, flat. You son of a bitch. Let me turn this up. Let me, hey, hey. What else? Whip it on the side, whip it in my lap. Okay. The niggas didn't rate little niggas rap. Or if it isn't H, if it isn't scrap. Yo, that's 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 the shit I also I'm just like, that's what be causing a problem. Like you niggas don't be trying to rate nobody. That's why I be trying to show love. Like, and it's not it's not fake love. There's too many talented little niggas to be like, oh well, like, there's only only olders that I listen to, or like niggas that I fuck with. I'm like, it's so stupid. These little niggas be teaching me so much. I'm like, wow. I never thought about it like that. It's so creative. Whip a little tape, nigga, look at that. Whip a little cake, whip a cookie bat. Yeah. I could teach you little niggas how to cook a pie. Seven rats, my little niggas, where your bookings at? Nah. Whip, whip, whip it, nigga, whip, whip, whip it. Whip it. I got six, six niggas in my bitch, wicked. <clears throat> Brought them backstage quick, I gave them six tickets. About to cut the pussy up, she called the dick scissors. Jeez. Bitch bend over, say my dick's biggest. biggest. Then she spanned the pussy on me, made my dick dizzy. Gee. Got a sharp XL out for them six digits. Yeah. Now I do this shit myself, I'm building sick bridges. <laughs> Observe them niggas, I got that fur die. I got worthy niggas, they know I. So, if I'm understanding his lyrics correctly, he actively. Actively is the worst word to choose, actually. Uh. He is acknowledging the fact that somebody put him down with at least 100 bags to get his shit going. Now he's up. Obviously, he's for sure and paid my nigga back at this point. But he's acknowledging that in the, in the middle of his shit. And then also talk about, like, and now I'm out here just leveling up and helping niggas myself because I'm just, I'm that kind of nigga. If I'm understanding this nigga correctly. Because the reason I ask this is, who the fuck is that nigga he name dropped in? I'd like to find out about that person. Because that's like uh, finding out who fucking Biggs is from Rockefeller. Most niggas don't even know that fucking Rockefeller was started with three people and not two. So that's why I'm just like, to hear the person who, not, maybe, not not the business moves, but like some of the street prominence of early Jay-Z, I would attribute to kind of how Giggs is revered over there. Or at least how I, I have to equate it being an American. So that's why I'm like, mm, I can see like the early parallels, everything before, like, up until Jay retires, that's where I would say Giggs' career is at currently. Does he have the opportunity to keep going? For sure. He really on them old nigga moves too. So it's good to see. But I'm just like, ah. Like, who's that nigga he's talking about? Jesus. Bitch bend over, say my dick's biggest. biggest. Then she spanned the pussy on me, made my dick dizzy. Jeez. Got a sharp XL out for them six digits. Yeah. Now I do this shit myself, I'm building sick bridges. <laughs> Observe them niggas, I got that fur die. I got worthy niggas, they know I earn mine. Yeah. 
turn them triggers and let them birds cry Man to burn them niggas with hitting bird's eye Sick, sick nigga and a sick rapper This is big bad holler man and big scrapper Got the swag dress now, This type of shit I would ride around with Like shit, I'm bumping this shit just, just driving around Like this type of shit a nigga wanna drive to This shit fire Down a little bit dapper yeah. Hit these bitch niggas up with the big whopper We keep it steady round here Oh, you mean niggas heavy round there? I heard he's got a little Desi down there. Weed smoke, little Medi round there. Bomb, we keep it steady round there. On your mask, get set, niggas ready round there. Ain't nobody lightweight, my niggas heavy round there. All my niggas brush up, niggas teddy round there. Bomb. Famous and dangerous, like some lions out the cage, cause they couldn't tame us. I'm whip whipping in my whip, I'm whipping with the stainless. And if I see him due to whip a nigga out his trainers, little pussies must have thought they could have contained us. Nah, man, we're the hardest niggas on the pavement. Niggas lying in their rap, talking this and talking that to tell the truth. It all sounds like prepared statements. I'm in the game, now these rappers trying to holler, man. It's real nigga rap, I had to. Nigga didn't flip his man's nickname for a fire bar. Ah. Shout my brother. I'm in the game, now these rappers trying to holler, man. It's real nigga rap, I had to shout my brother hollow, man. And if a nigga diss the program, and they make me whip my weapon out my pants, it's gonna mash up your tomorrow plan. I got my back against the wall, but that's the way I like it. I said I'll always be a G, I must have been a psychic. Riding round with my rider diet shit. She, she likes to get low, I make her bill it, but I always light it. It's real life, nothing's been recited. Jesus, that's what I'm talking about. I literally put that shit in the song like two days ago. It's one of the freestyles I just did, man. Roll my shit for me, girl. Stop playing. BSG, I must have been a psychic. Riding round with my rider diet shit. True, she likes to get low. I make her bill it, but I always light it. It's real life, nothing's been recited. We're still turning up at parties when we're not invited. I still smoke a lot of weed, cause that's exactly what I need to keep my head up in the skies, feeling like a pilot. And oh, forgot to mention all my niggas violent. Let me exercise my right to silence. Gold chain round my neck, staring in the mirror, singing. Kill a whole motherfucking family if a nigga tried it. Oh. Only because I know this nigga's background, I'm just like, these bars are just even crazy. <laughs> and because I've been, it's like a reverse of effect with, with gigs. I was like, oh, I was just a fan first. And then I found out that the nigga was sturdy. This nigga Scraps, I found it super sturdy. And now he's out here like, oh, he's nice on the fucking records. And then he talking like this. It's like, Ew, it's ugly. This, oh my god, that family bar is just wicked. Oh my god, this shit crazy. It's crazy, and it's crazy. I hear them two totally different ways because it's like I hear, it's like gigs I hear is like, oh, that's a nigga from the radio, even though I do know his background. This nigga scraps. I'm like, it's a wild ass nigga right there. That nigga crazy. <laughs> but that nigga selling that shit, and again. What I like about him is his shit's not too crazy. It's not lyrically like complex and nothing like, oh, he can't get like that. It's just more so he say some really good shit. It rhymes well. And then I'm just, I'm like, I resonate with that kind of thinking. I have no problem with this, actually. It's just crazy that you happen to also not only resonate with it lyrically, but you also, nigga, you be outside. <laughs> Damn. It's a good one. Hey, what's it? R187, hey, all right. Trust fall completed. It, it, you did this one. You did this one. This motherfucker, hey, this shit fire. Because I sure was going to say Giggs did all that heavy lifting like he did on that other song with whoever I can't remember. But I just remember, like, Giggs was killing it. Ah, Sneakbo, that's who it is. It was Giggs and Sneakbo. Sneakbo was cool, but I'm just like, Giggs did, like, pfft. oh, my God. All you had to do was a good verse. This nigga did everything. That's how I felt when I was listening to most of this. And then Scraps part comes, and it's like, oh, okay. I like this. I like this. Bomb, 
we keep it steady round here. On your mask, get set, niggas ready round here. Ain't nobody lightweight, my niggas heavy round here. All my niggas brush shot, niggas teddy round here. Hey, shout out to Storming, goddammit. That is twice today. I can get that nigga RIP, I believe. But it don't matter. Shout out that nigga, man. That shit terrible. I hate that shit. Ah, oh, man. that's He'd be one of the niggas that I say it all the time. Like, I'd be like, yo, man, you could take some of these whack niggas. I'd give you 50 whack niggas to get Teddy Bruckshot back right now. I know that's not a fair trade, but I would do it. And I'd have, I wouldn't think twice. Would not think twice. Be an easy trade. I don't give a fuck. But yeah, that's how I be feeling. So yeah. Uh, that's completely separate to this in this goddamn tangent I'm on. However, Scraps gigs around here, fire record, smart move by Scraps as well. Well played. This is chess for people that write songs or try and release music professionally and you're doing features with people. Pay attention to this song. What this song can teach you is, yeah, Scraps is homeboys with gigs. Them niggas know each other. However, he was not too big headed to be like, let me let this nigga go first. Have him be on the hook, but yet it's still my song, and I have the second verse. They're listening to this other nigga far more, but it's my record. But because they fuck with him so much, it will ingratiate his fans to want to listen to me at least. To be like, oh, well, is it nice? And then because, like I said, oh, this, this shit was nice. And now you're like, okay, well, let me see what Scraps is on. Let me listen to this nigga some more. Let me do X, Y, and Z. This is, again, what I'm saying. Like, this is chess. This is a, a way, like, look at the song. Look at what you've just had to deal with. And then you'll be like, oh, damn. This is just a puzzle. These niggas just put these pieces together. And that's really all this is. It's just, it's, it's. The part of marketing I do understand when it comes to the music shit, because I get that part of it. Like, how, how do we present it? The make niggas now want to listen to it? I can't be bothered. Nigga, press play or not, my shit's good. I don't have time. I'm not about to suck dick for plays. That shit's crazy. And I'm not buying them neither. Niggas be doing the most. That shit's crazy. That's why I sell songs to people. I don't have time to be running around fucking trying to lie to niggas to get plays. That shit's weird. Press play, don't. Say it's trash, cool. Don't give a fuck. But. This shit was fire. Shout out to R187. Thank you very much. That's going to be it for me. I'll see you niggas on the next one. Uh, more scraps, more gigs. Put me on. Yeah, I'm happy to listen to either of them niggas. I don't think either of them have missed since I've started, at least for me. Not in a gigs verse on that P Money record. That beat just was trash. Like, why do you make that man do that shit? That's more so what it is. That's not even a miss. So, yeah, my, my nigga gigs don't miss. And scraps has not missed yet. Literally. But uh yeah, I see you niggas on the next one. I'm at it. Peace.